it's never been opened. Golden. We're we'll breaking into a safe, Anna. Well, I'm hoping there's some treasure in there. Oh my God. Oh. Hi, I'm Ed. And I'm Anna. We run a wedding business from Ed's family's 15th century chateau near Bordeaux. On this channel, you'll get to see what our life is like while discovering Bordeaux, surrounding area, and what the wine world has to offer. Anna, I need your help uh, to move some furniture in the chateau. Furniture? Is yeah. it going to be hard work? Uh, no, just one piece. Come on. Okay, I'll come. What you doing with the towels? I'm protecting the floor because it's going to make a mess. My job. So you mean after whatever job we're doing, we're going to have to do cleaning as well? And a little bit of plasterboarding and re repairing of a wall. We just did some. And some painting. Some painting, okay. Fair enough. So where exactly are we going? Uh, Centre Steph. Not, not the town in the left bank. About an hour and a half away. The bedroom centre stairs. Bedroom centre stairs. Okay then. Come on. Up. I'm coming. There you go. You've stripped the bed and everything. But yeah, it's going to make about a mess. So what's going on? Because I see you've moved furniture around. Not really. No. I've not moved anything, can you just help me move this over here? Okay, wait. Now what's next? Well, I need to get a set of ladders and move these out the of the curtains. way because I don't want the curtains getting dirty. You know why? No. We painted the... No, what are we doing? We're getting rid of... Well, getting that out. The safe? Well, yeah, it's never been opened. Well, I'm hoping there's some treasure in there. And you sh have you checked with Mam Babe that they Yeah, I've got the green light off Mam Babe. Whilst they're here, obviously, they want to see as well if there's anything in there. So You've I heard these stories of people uh, demolishing Chateau to find the treasure. So are we looking for treasure? Yeah. Treasure hidden in the old safe that has been here for hundreds of years? No, not hundreds of years. Maybe from the 60s, 50s, I don't know. I don't know how old safes are. I don't know, but Billy knows a lot about safe, so wow. it's a shame. He, ca he can't be here to help us. There's a line there. I don't know if that's got something to do with it. But it's yeah. it we're just going to literally... So yeah, down. but that sounds full. Oh, yeah, it's concrete. That's, yeah. But the concrete only comes to here. So you're going to break concrete? Oh, yeah. We're getting this puppy out. Don't break everything. Well, the thing is, right, do we really want to um, to just open it? No. Well, wasn't it's ugly. Didn't we just have a picture frame on top of it so no one knew there was a safe here? Oh, well, yeah, but it's ugly. I don't like it. And also, it... there could be treasure at the, at the bottom. There could be treasure, okay. So you want to go and hunt for treasure? Yeah, treasure hunt. Treasure hunt. Okay, then. Right, so I'm going to go and... Get my stuff, get ready, and uh, try and get into it. Okay, well, off you go. I'll just have a look. So that's why you, you, you had your towels and things. Oh, yeah, I'm going to put them out here. Yes, yeah, so protect the floor. The Fair floor. enough. Yeah, a, uh, like a, a thinner thing wouldn't have done the job. Now, and look at the view from here, guys. Sorry, I have a thing about the view. And every time, just to show you all what the terrace looks like now. Oh, look at the pool there in the corner. Yeah, maybe get step on this
See you in a bit, Ed. Look at this view, guys. It's like 30 degrees now in the shade. It looks absolutely amazing. So whilst I'm waiting for Ed, I'm gonna just check on the roses and that had that had them so they can flower and they're gonna look beautiful all pretty much until end of till end of December we have roses most years. I said I was going to get ready. Are you a burglar or something? We're all breaking into a safe, Anna. <laughs> but it's your... It's, it's the family safe, but I mean... It's, well, it's not really, is it? <laughs> no. You, you, you took it a bit too seriously. No, no wonder Charles likes to dress. Yeah, no, can't get in with that. Okay, what are you going to do now? Well, I'm considerate cat burglar. Because I'll take the curtains well, down so I don't make You're gonna steal the curtains. <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> no, I'm gonna take the curtains down so okay, I don't I'll make a mess. I'll help you. I'll there help you. Help you I am heavy. Okay. Oh, I did push them all towards you. Consider it, cat burglar. Taking yes. curtains down not to make a mess. Yes. So you may look at this little drill and think, that's not gonna get very far on this safe. But it pays to know the previous owner. Everything he did was crap. <laughs> so I'm hoping that if I just take tack away the outside here, it won't be too. Uh, it won't be too kind of. And won't, won't that set off the burglar alarm? Yeah, it might set off the fire. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Absolute rubbish. I'm gonna have to take my goggles off. <laughs> It's very noisy and I'm going to check. How's it going? Because it's very dusty here now. I mean, look at all of that. Uh, he's actually done a good job. Obviously, he's, he's done, done a good job. He's got a contractor in. <laughs> of course, he would do, wouldn't he, for a sake? But I can see like metal piece, pieces going back there. I tried whacking the front of it. It does actually look if I went at the front a bit a bit more I'd get into it, but at the end of the day we don't want it to stay here, so <coughs> may as well carry on. Do you want to take a break or are you gonna continue? Oh no no no. You continue. Yeah, as soon as I get it done, soon we can get it open. How's it going then? This concrete is like granite. I don't know what they've done to make it like that. It's obviously some kind of special technique. Maybe you just used fresh concrete, no sand. Uh, fresh cement, no sand. We're getting quite down. Oh my God. What? Well, it's quite big. You're joking. No, it's massive. Well, when you look at the size of the wall. Uh, let's hope it doesn't go all the way through. All right, I'm gonna get on. Okay. I think if I get one side free, I might be able to get my crowbar in and see how yeah. it goes. Just 
came to money, you didn't mind spending the money. <laughs> <laughs> this is a really good job. Can you imagine not having the electric tool? There's no way you'd have got this out. I've got quite advanced with it, but still, it doesn't seem to be coming yet. There you go. It looks very hard work there. Concrete that I'm struggling getting out. There we go. It's still there. I've got like 30, 40 centimeters back and it's still bigger. I thought this was just going to be fairly small. Safe, but it's absolutely huge. Still not hitting the back of it yet. Okay. I mean, look. Yeah, that goes quite far. 20, 30, 30 centimeters so far. Can you take a break? No, because I want to get as far as possible. Is that, that's not just not moving, is it? No, it's not really moving. Okay. All right, let me continue for a bit. Okay. And I'll call you if anything happens. Okay. Okay. Bye. I've got the big guns out, and I, unfortunately. <laughs> Yeah. It's a bit temperamental. It's very old. Um, and very powerful. Not anymore. Oh God. It's like an old man. <laughs> it's lost its power. Are oh, you cheeky thing? <laughs> we'll give it another go, but I found out why I'm struggling to get it out. It's got a lip that's set in the concrete. If you look down there, you can probably see it. Oh, so yeah. that lip needs to be free, or at least half of the way around, or three quarters of the way around, might get it out then. You look very powerful there with that special big tool. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> You're having too much fun, man. Oh. Being covered in dust and rubble and concrete, God, it's so bad. Yeah, I mean. it's like, right, imagine a Ferrari with a metro engine. Oh. Uh, what's a metro for people outside of the UK? Um, a, a beetle engine. A Ferrari with a beetle engine. <laughs> That's what this is. Sometimes it'll work. So you're the Ferrari? Well, yeah, look at the guns. <laughs> Hammering. It'll drill if I want to drill, but I don't think drilling's going to do that. Here's another bit of bad news. Go on. If I. Are you tapping it? Yeah, it sounds decidedly hollow. <laughs> but you know what? There's no, more, normally more than one leveling. Say, so. so you're telling me that you might, we might have done all of this for nothing? Well, to be fair, when we set out on this task, we did think it might be for nothing, and who's going to leave stuff in a safe? But you never know. How's it going then? Oh, you're equipped now. Yeah, I wasn't going to be disc-cutting without. Disc-cutting? Well, I've got, I've kind of come to the conclusion that it's bolted in at the back. And I think it's got mega reinforcement at the back. I, I couldn't believe the guy's done such a good job on this. <laughs> um, so I'm just trying to cut into it. I was just playing around with this side. So good. you underestimated him? Yeah, and I was just playing around with the... Um, oh my god, you have the big drill and everything. You have the... Big tools now. I had that earlier on. Oh, the long drill bit. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I tried that. It didn't work either. All my best stuff's in the now, so I'm struggling 
So, I've got a little bit of the metal off. I mean, so you're chopping it off now? Yeah, and then I can get to the bolts at the back after I've found the treasure. So it's like we're chopping off a safe? Yeah, we're chopping the safe up. I really should have the black, black uh, mask back on for this. You should go into it full time. <laughs> What's you his mean name? Ro Ronnie, his is it Ronnie Beeks? What's his name? I think your first job, you, you'll, be, <laughs> you'll be locked up on the first job <laughs> at this rate. <laughs> I know. The cops would be here to get him, wouldn't they? Oh. These oh. are obviously some kind of locking oh. mechanism here, but. Is, have they put some in the wall then at the back when they. Yeah, they must have, they could have put anything in there, it could be massive. Yeah. It's demoralising. Is it going through the front all right? Yeah, it will do. I'm only on my second disc and I didn't use the whole of it. I'll sort of <laughs> cut there, cut there. Why not just cut that centre out first? You might be able to unlock it. That? Yeah. Well, that's what I'm doing. Yeah, right. But whilst you're here and whilst Anna's here filming, I can't do much. Why? Well, because we're getting it. Yeah. What? It's dead noisy. All right, well, not for good for me then. You two out and let me continue and I'll call you when it's... Uh, Almost out. Yeah, when I can bend it open. The last liner. Yeah, no, th this was a no-go on the front. Basically, I've cut, still hot, I've cut the side um, and I've managed to bend this and it's bending so that I can open the door. So I'm just waiting <laughs> for mum and dad to come because they want to see it open. And look how far it goes, girls. It's massive, but like I say, I'd be surprised if there's much in there. So any papers in there aren't burnt if there's papers. <laughs> so how is it going, guys? Right. So I cut the front plate off. There was another plate behind and I was like, no, I've got to be better than this get it off better so this was already cut off and I noticed that these two here must be where those bolts go through so I cut on the side and I can get my crowbar in and it just started opening so I quickly called everyone where's he gone Have you Charles what do you think is in there I think it's a treasure box with some money inside treasure box with money I wish <laughs> I'm not sure and I hope he'll be You're funny ready. Come close, guys. Come close. Oh, 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 oh my God! What? Absolutely nothing. Oh. Did Did you actually think there was going to be anything? No, I didn't know we shared the chest. Oh, this time there's nothing. Nothing, Charles. Right, nothing. forget it now, Edward. Come and have a beer downstairs. <laughs> so you 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 made all this mess. And go on. Come on, I can't believe it. Well, what would you have done if there was gold and silver well, and jewels, hey, Charles? We'd be going out for dinner. Yeah. <laughs> Exactly, you'd have kissed it. A magnum of champagne, come on, it's wine time now. <laughs> come on. And get me a uh, drink. Oh I'm my God, the, the mess you've made. Come on. It's a quick fix, Anna. So how's the treasure hunt? Well, you know what? I figured out next time <laughs> that I can just get round here. Yeah? Cut this side off, cut there off, and then pry it open. What do you mean next time? There won't be a next time. 
We don't have any more saves here. No, we don't. Try to break it. Leave it alone now. Leave it alone. All I'm thinking is all that repair just for that. Looks well, good fun. It How many hours work? Three hours, three and a half hours work. Three and a half hours you drilling, and now how many hours to cleaning all this? Um, yeah, but we're gonna get rid of this. This has been bugging me for ages, so <laughs> we can get rid of that. Fill the thing back in. This room needed a quick paint anyway, so we'll give it. Oh, <laughs> this paint. room needed a quick paint. That lets you paint the mess. Yeah. I mean, look at all the dust I have to clean. Yeah, you had too much well, on there. Yeah, but what would you have done? What would you have done if there were jewels and things? I would have been very happy if there had been jewels here or anything like that. Yeah, I bet you'd have tried to wear them, wouldn't you? Oh, well, I would have told your mum. What, and you'd have, you'd have both been playing around with them, wearing them? Well, Emma would have tried to get them. Yeah, Emma would have got them first. Come on, let's let's go and have a wine. It's wine o'clock, Anna. It is definitely wine o'clock, and you've worked really hard at breaking a wall, breaking into a safe. You, you, I can see you have the head down there. Are you upset? <laughs> Imagine the fun you're gonna have cleaning up that room now. I'm not cleaning it. <laughs> you made it. You better clean it. I'm off. You're off! Oh no. Cheers. Cheers. To the safe and all the treasure that wasn't in there. I didn't think there would be. Did you really, Edward? I, I think he share it. <laughs> he hoped, he hoped. I hoped there was diamonds. Oh, Charles wanted some history <laughs> hey. in there. Yeah, there was nothing in there, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Look, just look at Edward's face. It's like when I hacked off that landing, but I had goggles on and I, ha I just had two round marks for my eyes. The rest of it was like that. that he looks up? fed up. What's going on, Peter? What did you say? Looks powdered up. He, yes. he definitely looks powdered up. Mm -hmm. I mean, he looks like he's been in a furnace. Oh, I mean, he could have left just like a couple of quid in there for me. You know, for good something. Luck. For good luck, you made Edward. old France. Yeah, anything! Anything just say, oh, there was something in there. There's, there wasn't even a bit of dust in there. How did it go 20 years and no dust in there? Well, maybe well, because it was bed. locked there. <laughs> the viral. You play him! Um, yeah, the the thing is, is, Edward, I knew there'd be nothing because he was a very careful man with money, wasn't he? I mean, that's why I think he, he probably asked, needed it as well by the end. He probably end, did, because he was in his 80s. And as long as he was... Okay. Uh, well, he was okay for quite a while afterwards. Oh. Look at her, man. She looks oh. adorable. Don't with, leave me behind. With her bag, her hat, and her bottle of water.